Which which Hitmon is the best? Hitmon Dot. You're right. And then Hitmon Lee. Hitmon Jan sucks. I agree. Changed my mind. I don't think I've ever met a person who actually like genuinely likes Hitmon Lee or not Hitmon Lee. Hitmon Chan more than the other two. It's good. It's because there aren't any people. Those people don't exist. I wonder if they do, then natural selection is gonna do something. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Tell me I'm wrong! Okay, do you, do you check, um, YouTube's trending tab often? Not too often, to be honest. I used to. Have you been on, have you been on it the last couple days? No, I have not. So, do you know who Lil Dicky is? Yes. He put out a new song uh, for Earth Day, which, um, depending on if we've split this episode yet, might have been today, or it will have been yesterday. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> but he put out a song about Earth Day, and it's got, like, 30 other artists in it and the music video for it is fucking awesome i haven't seen it yet but i heard it's, it was it's um, called earth i, yeah. I think it's still like it's still like in the top 10 on trending right now um i'll watch it and it's all the money from it gets donated to uh like environmental nonprofits. um all the money from like any like if you have like itunes or whatever and you stream it all the money from that goes to the nonprofit. It's it's really awesome, actually. Yeah. So highly recommend. Ten out of ten. I feel like we're like obviously we're probably gonna split this episode anyways. Like we've gotten just so y'all know we've gotten to this point where like we're just recording one hour long episode and then splitting in half. Yeah. It's honestly a lot easier because otherwise we're gonna sit here and talk for like twenty minutes before each episode, each time we start recording. So. It's become easier for us, but uh, my encounter was a Slugma, just so you know, and I don't know what to name him. Okay, well, at least that doesn't help you very much. Nah. I do need a fire type, though, and I do like Mad Cargo. But it... But he's slow as shit. I do really like Mad Cargo, but it's just not good. Yeah. What do you nickname a, um... Boy. You name it Gary. Dark. Oh my god, why did I think of that? I had like a, you know, I can't think today. Or you can name it Rocky from the episode where they, uh, had no. the snail race. No, we're not doing that. Patrick, it's a rock. Yeah, I know. He's got nerves of steel. That entire episode. No that words. That's a great episode, don't It's so that. good. No, it's good. It's just like, it's, it's so stupid that it's good. The trainers in this this route are bro oh god god damn it every time i try to get past a trainer and sneak past them it just never happens good that's literally all i can ask for right now they always turn around as i'm stepping in front of them and it's the most aggravating bullshit to ever exist on there okay Switch am, only I fighting, am i fighting the gym right now do i really want to <laughs> are you do you think you're ready to take on the gym are you at the gym leader yet, or have you? Yes, you not? I'm standing right in front of her. So honestly, it's gonna take me like a whole episode to get to that gym leader. So I think I kind of have to risk it for the biscuit at this point, because this is what badge six. Yeah, we're at this point yeah. where probably the only the last chance I'm gonna have to catch up are um, the end of the team flare stuff and victory road. It, I mean, honestly, it depends. Like I said, my team is not very balanced at all. I have two ground types. Um, I have basically no answer for water types. Yeah, except I'm also so which, I'm she's, more or less. Sends out a man time, which is cool. I'm more or um, less solo running with a. Oh, this bitch has horn drill. There's a seeking on my screen. I'm my my jump you're, you're, bluff is one level you're below. If you put a higher level in it, you're fine. My moon my my jump bluff's one level below it. I don't know. Can I outspeed it? And will it click horn drill? And will it land? On a jump bluff? You'll definitely outspeed it. I'm gonna bullet seed it and see what happens. It outsped me and used poison jab. I think my jump bluff's dead. Oh. Yep. 
Is it really? I 100%, yeah, he's dead. I 100%, I'm really sad. <laughs> I was not expecting this thing to I pull out. I definitely thought that you would outsmart Poison jump jab. It's pretty fast. It, it's, it's raining. Jump bluffs, jump bluffs. It's raining. Uh... I completely forgot that that thing, it gets swift swim, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. I, it does, but I always think of it having um, lightning rod. I know, that's a, I always think it's going to have lightning rod. Now, what I'm afraid of is it's raining. Um, my Swampert 7 level is ahead of it. I'm going to heal to see how much a water type move will do to me. And hopefully I don't get stalled out and swept by a Seeking. Because at that point, it's game set. It's got fucking waterfall. I swallow in fact, it in the rain. Waterfall is actually a Gen 1 move. Who learns it in Gen 1? Just Seeking. I think I'm Interesting. So, it using Waterfall as a three hit, and okay. I can't hit a Mud Bomb to save my life, so I guess I'm gonna start using Strength and or Growl to uh, lower its attack. Because <coughs> if I get crit, I'm fucked. I'm clicking Strength. It still outspeeds me, and I'm seven levels ahead of it, in a, like, but I'm also a Swamper. So. How much right, does the Strength do? Case. Aromatis, you gotta carry me through this gym, fam. Are you still fighting the Mantine, or did you kill it? I'm still fighting the Mantine. I'm getting so I'm getting stalled by a Sea King, and you're getting stalled by a Mantine. See, I'm not so much getting stalled as I'm getting. I, I'm really hard predicting this thing, honestly, because um, I'm now at plus four. Mm-hmm. Because I know Calm Mind. Yeah. So I'm either at plus three, or plus four. And, um, so he went for Hydro Pump, hit me once, and then missed twice. Mm -hmm. I hit him with a Moon Blast and lowered his special attack, so now he's bouncing. Oh. So I Calm Minded on the first turn to bounce, and on when it would have, uh, or w when she healed, too, because I got down to, like, 10%. Mm-hmm. Let's go, Aromatis. This fucking stupid thing And you got called a Aromatis crit. a bad Pokemon. I, it's still a bad Pokemon. It's still disgusting. You're it's ugly as shit. Are you gonna bounce again? Aromatis, you're coming in. We're now at like plus five. Which I think is probably a little older. Like, it, it bounces. I feel like you can, I feel like you can, I feel like you can sweep her entire team unless she throws out a poison type. Um, so what is, what is my little set? Um, I know I have Moonblast, I know I have Signal Beam. And I have Dark Pulse. So, I can just hit it with the Dark Pulse. And, yeah. Like, Aromatis is pretty heckin' thick. Yeah, that thing's probably gonna with, eat. Hits. I got hit with three bounces and I did not get paralyzed. That's the first time I, I, really, for my past like less play experience, bounces like a one hundred percent paralysis chance. It feels just like from, it, don't just it? Just from personal experience. I'm so annoyed with this. I hate that I got stuck in the stupid water and that stupid ranger. <laughs> A ranger turns around and stares at me, and now it has a cure on white. I'm getting rid of Swords Dance on my Lucario for Calm Mind. What do I do in this situation? It's a cure on white on my screen. Um, it's raining, it's... so I'm going into my... I'm going into my... Uh, Mawa? No. I'm going into my... Swamp I'm switched into Swamper, yeah. It just used Fusion Flare. I'm swallowing that. It's fine. I've never seen a fusion flare do so little damage. I'm surfing it. Oh wait, it's um, it's still ice it's dragon, dragon isn't. Ice, yeah. It just used ice burn. What is that? Uh, it's a two turn like base 120 or 150, something like that. Uh, ice type move. Is this gonna kill my? Yes. Swampert? <laughs> I hope not. I'm mud bombing. i It missed. That's so- I hate that. How can a two-turn move miss? I think that's so dumb. Yeah, isn't fly like 95% accurate? Yeah. It's really stupid. I don't understand, like, because it doesn't- it, you're right, it doesn't make sense why it should miss. I just- I just lowered its accuracy two stages, so if it hits this ice burn, I'm gonna scream. Wow, it hit its ice burn. <laughs> Is this gonna kill my- my Swampert? Um... No, but it burns me. Good to know. Yeah, it does. I don't even think that's a guaranteed thing. No, I'm just really unlucky. 
So, it almost kills me. Oh, I have two full restores. What am I doing? I don't know where I got these full restores from. Oh, I got them from the... Cena and Dexio. Oh, that's right. It's ice burning again. Oh, boy. All I have to do is, like, hit it with the strength, and I'm probably fine. Hits two ice burns in a row after missing the first, after its accuracy has been dropped twice. The logic. Why That's does... RNG, man. I just don't understand. I've had so many mo I've lost, like, a number of mons to RNG, even when I'm, like, set up to survive. Like, I had a... Having a... I don't understand how having a plus three evasive... Drift limb, a that a type null manages to hit a rock slide, and one shot me. Really not sure how that worked, but you know, it's what it is. Oh god! Oh, that's so much damage. I walked straight into another trainer. I'm gonna, I'm not gonna be able to catch up because I keep running into these people. Oh god. On the bright side, I'm getting level. Really screw my team. If you run into, like, a Kyogre, it's over. Well, there's a Kingler on the screen. Oh, that thing's got a guillotine. And I don't know... Oh, god, it might. Oh, higher level. He definitely has guillotine. At this level. I've oh, learned it... that Mons for no reason. The Mons that learn one-shot moves, learn them in, like, the 30s. Oh, if Hero oh, would drill right. He keeps crab-hammering me. Oh. Which, okay, fortunately, we do live a crit from full. And I know it's not the most accurate, so I just have to now heal spam. Until, yeah. Until it misses one. I got crab hammered in the rain by a by a life orb. Uh, <laughs> caught on, and I really wasn't ready for it. I had I spent I spent a whole day like grinding up a Pangoro and it you know, guys it's first battle on screen. Do a crab hammer in the rain from a life orb caught on. Nice it didn't even deserve Renegade it. Platinum. Like, Drowner knows that you're gonna have to grind, so he gives you a dedicated grinding person. Yeah, I don't really have that in, um... I don't really have that number, Moon. I'm basically set to suffer. I've gotten to this point where I, I've avoided so many trainers that... Dude, there were mess parades in this grass. I'm risking it. What happened? I feel like if Let's you... Let's go. <sighs> I feel like if you lose... Like, I feel like at this point, you have a lot of mons that... Like, a lot of heavy hitters, that even losing one isn't the most detrimental to you. Well, no, if I lose this Aromatis, I literally have absolutely nothing. For water for, types. To even, to even send in on a water Dude, type. okay, so I just ran into a Mesper, right? Literally, yeah. my next encounter is an Azelf. I had Azelf on that route, too. Dude, Azelf is the best of the liquids. See, personally, I like Yuxi. Personally. I love all three of them, but the, I don't know why. I, don't I just like love... Mesprit. I don't mind Mesprit. I guess how yeah, I that's, yeah, I guess that's more accurate. Because for me, it definitely goes Yuxi as of Mesprit, but I don't like dislike Mesprit, you know? Yeah, there's also Star You here. I'm running into Mons in the water every five seconds, and I don't have spells. That was my See, that's what happened to me earlier this episode, so I'm hoping that it. Oh, of course you live on one. Well, it's gonna happen to me plus running into trainers, and then I'm gonna run into a Pokemon while trying to avoid a trainer, and then get caught by said trainer. Oh, How that's exactly what you have. Happened. I think you have one more after this. So we're pulling the guy. I think the Slugma was like. Definitely. The Slugma definitely wasn't the worst encounter because there's a Wormhole right here. No, that's fine. That's, that, oh my god, that's power. That's options. Like, you could evolve into either Pokemon. You, you have two options. Yeah, but you don't really. You don't really. You don't choose. It's, it's random. Uh, no, it depends on the time of day. Desktop, uh, evolving into Dustox or. But or beautiful eye, yeah. Is that a recent thing? Because last I checked, it was like a like IV almost thing. That's no, what I've always been told. That, that's been a thing since Gen three. I thought I the, thought the, it's... the only time when it wasn't was Diamond and Pearl because for whatever reason they were version exclusives. Interesting. I didn't know that. I thought it was um. I thought it was based off of. Uh... Like, it was like IV or some stupid shit like that? No, it's, it's, as far as I know, it's always been time of day. Because I feel like I've, I feel like I've had different, um, like, 
evolutions at this around the same time of day. Maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. But also that that whole like haunted house thing is stupid and it shouldn't exist. You should be you should be allowed to be that like one Are really shitty there? friend. Yeah, I'm about to get to my I'm I'm I just did it. And I'm annoyed. Now I can almost guarantee that you're gonna have the off you're gonna have the chance to catch up because I'm gonna take 12 years in this gym. So yeah, there's that. And I should really be switch training my other mods, but I feel like I'm gonna get shadow tagged out of nowhere and I'll lose a mod. And I should probably put my I jump bluff. So. I should put my jump bluff in the box. <clears throat> I don't have any grass I mean, types, you, did, you did lose your third strongest mom this episode, so I guess I can't really complain. Yeah. I have such a... There's so much power in this box of dead mons. That's really ridiculous. Alright, I guess I'm bringing the slug mon to the team. <clears throat> it's adamant nature. <laughs> also, it ancient powered me while I was trying to catch it, and instantly got the ancient power boost, so... Hey, that's a good, that's a good luck mon. I hope. How many... I'm gonna buy 26 Hyper Potions. I should probably buy... Which which Hitmon is the best? Hitmon Top. You're right. And then Hitmon Lee. Hitmon Chan sucks. I agree. Changed my mind. I don't think I've ever met a person who actually, like, genuinely likes Hitmon Lee. Or not Hitmon Lee. Hitmon Chan more than the other two. It's because there aren't any people. Those people don't exist. And if they do, the natural switch is gonna do it. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Tell me I'm wrong! Hey, can I find, like, I need a- I need to look up where to get Moonstone in this game. Um... I have no idea off the top of my head. Where's the gym? Badge number six. This is the Pokeball Factory, I don't do that until later. You just got your badge? Yep. Lit, alright. Oh, and guess what my TM is? Completely useless. I got Icicle Crash from Clement, and only my Knit Arena can learn it. I got Slack Off. Oh, lovely. Literally useless. Alright, so I'm just gonna say it, preface this that we're at tw 40 minutes, so I was gonna say you wanna get to like 44, 45 minutes, and then. Yeah, that's fine. See how it goes. Now I know. Especially at this point, uh, since my three strongest mods are a Mega Mawile, a Swamper, and a Wormadam. <laughs> um, <laughs> I definitely feel like I'm going to switch train my, my Alakazam, but I also don't want to sit here and fight every single trainer here. So I'm going to just see if I can get lucky and get straight to the gym. I'll fight like every other room I go into. There's also, there's not people in every room. Yeah. Like... I, I think I got there as quick as possible without really trying. So, so you can you can definitely do it. There's a blaze on my screen. It's like 44. I don't know. Excuse me. I picked the wrong room. Going into my swamper. This fucker tried to flare blitz my Alakazam. <laughs> no, thank you. It burned me! I hate this game. <laughs> RNG is bullshit. Alright, Pokeball Factory. It's a speed it. boost Blaziken? Are you fucking with me? I hate this game. I just ran into a speed boost Blaziken, dude. That's his yeah, hidden up- a, isn't that it? Blaze! Come on! What the fuck? Isn't Bla- isn't- isn't speed boost its hidden ability? So mad. This thing just high jump kicked me. High jump kick does 40, like 49%, and I want to see if it's a, if that was a low roll or a high roll. Because if I get high rolled high jump kick and lose my um, Swamper, I lose this game. To this place again. So, uh, okay, so a high roll does over half. That's lit. <laughs> you know what? Uh, you know what? Blaziken actually. Blaziken and Infernape and Embor. I guess if you want to count that thing, um, can destroy my team. Probably Blaziken and Infernape more just because they have access to high jump kit and close combat. I don't know if Embor does Embor get either. I don't think Embor gets um, close combat, does it? It might get close combat. No. Actually, no, it gets it only gets superpower. 
Oh, well then, yeah, they could all murder me. Can you miss a high jump kick? It's hit all of its high jump kicks. It's 90% accurate. Miss one and crash. Please. Well, yeah, I mean, if, if it's... If it only goes for three, like, it's statistically, it's going to hit all of them. It just missed one. It did over half to it. That's wild. What is the statistic for um, how much high jump kick will do in recoil damage if you miss? Half. Half of what you would have done? No, it's just 50% of your HP. Oh. That's horrible. And, so basically, if you're um, below a half. I know in, I, yes, if you're below half and you miss, you die. And you um, said in Gen 2 it was messed up, so it's like it did the damage you would have done. Yes. Which is like. Might as well not use. Crazy. Guess I'm not using that. It's like, okay. Because you could easily Oko yourself from full. Absolutely, yeah. Which sounds absolutely terrible. So I'm gonna. I had that, ha I had that happen to me. Dude. I guess I didn't I didn't die, but it, I came very, very close. Very close to getting Oko. Am I already to the gym leader? I am not. Let's see. Am I now to the gym leader? I am not. Are you doing the Pokeball Factory stuff right now, by the way? Yep. Shit. Right. And it's so... fun, because I forgot that you, like, when you're on the conveyor belt thing, you, like, squat. Oh. So, I'm at this point where I want to try to He's... actually get in front of the gym leader before we end this episode. That's but fine. I don't think I'm going to be able to make it, because I don't know I, how to get I through this stupid... I literally just made it through... Did I make that one? No. Do any of you people give me things? That's the real question. I need another episode of you sitting on Bulkpedia. Yeah, no, I made that mistake already. No thanks. Yeah. Do you still have your uh, EXP share on, by the way? Yes. Alrighty. Uh, should I turn it off after this episode? Uh, yeah. And then right. I guess we'll both keep them off until we're both getting demolished by these high-leveled mods. What was her ace for you? I don't wait. The what Pokemon? What was her? Well, what was her highest level? I don't remember. <laughs> So, I, okay. I I really don't because I sent out my uh, oh casual Zekron on the screen that's fine. Um, cool. I sent out my Aromatis uh -huh. and uh, just got to plus five. Yeah. And just swept. So there's no way there's only like you know I think there's like what probably six or nine rooms and I've somehow only gone into every one that's not the gym leader room. I feel like I've been in the same corner room like four times now. I've been going back and forth from the corner room and the entrance of the gym. That is what my day is. Oh god. Are we gonna go back to the I corner got, room? I just got bolt strick. Oh my god. By what? Or what mon was out? Uh, my aromatis. Because initially, my... Uh, Garchomp was out because I'm trying to train it, but I'm like, well, it's gonna outspeed me and like Dragon Claw me, and then it whipped out an Outrage, so luckily I switched. But um, all right, we'll switch to we'll switch to my Gliscor and see how that works. You should be fine. At, le at least that can't be bolt stricken. It can be Outrage, but I don't think an Outrage is gonna hurt an all that much. An, an, out an Outrage won't kill. Insert. Uh, and we and we outspeed anyway, so we're fine. Insert intro moment of you getting critted. Just kidding. It did not kill. It didn't kill, but you didn't outspeed? Or I, I outsped, but it did not kill. And his outrage did like 60 per <coughs> No, or like 40%. Oh, trying. lit. Am I going to get to this stupid gym leader yet? No. Okay. Nope. I don't know. This gym sucks. I've been through. I've been ev into every room except for the gym leaders. Sounds like you need to get good. Get good. I don't understand. That, that what's doesn't going sound on. like a struggle of somebody who's good. I have genuinely gone into every single room except for hers. What is the? There. Yeah. I feel like there's just no pattern. It's like every gym leader, every gym trainer you fight, it gets a little easier to teleport. This that has. Doesn't make any sense. That, that doesn't make any sense. It's just statistically randomly it takes you to random rooms every time. That'd be fucked up. I could see them doing that. There we go. I'm in a room. All right, let's end the episode here. Okay. It's your episode. 
I mean, I Are you in a battle? Like I was... Oh, okay. No. Alright, thank you guys very much for watching. If you enjoyed this video as much as we did, make sure to smash that thumbs up button down below. Uh, check out Nick's channel. Um, he's, you know, we talk about Soul Lake a lot, and it's honestly so fun to listen <laughs> to him and Joe argue. Argue like an old married couple. This guy just got married. a goodbye, and I can almost guarantee he's gonna lose it. Like, within three what, or four what's episodes. It, what's it linked with? Uh, I think it's linked with, um, I have the list. I wanna check it. Let's find out. What are, what is his mod linked to? His goodbye is linked to my Pancham. Ooh, that's a good pick. Also, we have a Torterra and a, lo a Mega Loth on eight. So if we lose, then we just are really bad. We have two deaths right now. Spoiler alerts, everyone. But all, both in the same episode and one from both of us. So if that tells you how good we are. Except also, mine was because I crit a Relicanth and it had Anger Point. And oh, it started yeah. rock tombing me. Yeah, I, I and I had that. to sack it off. Joe's was because he's an idiot. <laughs> so I yeah, mean, like, true. all things considered, <laughs> we'll find out who's better at this game. <laughs> I'm still gonna cause us to lose. I can almost guarantee it. I mean, look at your luck in this game so far. So <laughs> yeah, I lost my entire squad to a Velt. <laughs> if I were doing a Velt all in Soul Link, I might cry. That that would be so funny. Be so anyway, let's get out of here. Um, like I said, thank you guys very much for watching. Follow us both on Twitter. Um, check out my second channel, Palette University, which focuses mainly on Pokemon science, Pokemon theories, etc. And until next time, smile later.